Hello, in this CyberStart cybersecurity tutorial, we'll be doing the intern base level 2, challenge 4, rover rodeo. So we can see that there is a rover that we have to control and the software used to control the rover wasn't completed in time. So our goal is manually um, instruct the rover using the browser's console. The tip here is use the browser's developer console. So that gives us a hint to directly go to the web developer tools and head over to the console. And usually it's probably a function we need to call. So let's explore. So let's say move. These don't seem to be um, doing anything. So let's try rover. And let's see if there's a hint. In the rover interface, we can see that there are um, other functions we can call. So like there's a position and etc. So here we see that there is a drill function. I would assume we would do that when we get to the flag. There is a move function that takes in the length, so an integer. And then there's also a turn function, so it could turn. So let's try this. So let's do rover.move. And let's move it to because we'll go up here. Great. And I think we have to turn the rover now. So we'll do rover.turn. And let's do it right. I believe that's how it works. Okay. I'm looking. Press the up arrow to go back into commands we type. So rover that move. Let me press up arrow again, and this time make that left. And this time we'll do rover dot move, but we only need to do it once. And now we need to turn right again and move up twice, or move to the right twice. Interestingly, something happened here. A mineral deposit has been detected. Drill down to collect the sample. Great, so now we can use the drill function. So we actually didn't use that before. So rover dot drill. Make sure you have your parentheses. Okay, it looks like it has completed drilling. So let's do rover dot move. Great, now we need to turn to the right. And let's continue moving. This time we'll just move one. Now we need to turn to the left. So let's go back up a bit. And we can move forward three times this time. And we'll turn left. And I think this should complete it. Great, so we have completed this challenge. In this challenge, we have learned how to manipulate the web developer tools and a bit of coding. See you in the next challenge.